And welcome back to Lego Star Wars. I can't stop recording this, um, but here we go. Um, honestly, yeah, never mind, let's just do this and I'll find later. Episode 3, Revenge of the Sith, the second before final, I'm saying that. Chapter 4, for, uh, Defense on a Kashyyyk. Obi-Wan Kenobi has taken care of General Grievous, but the Clone Wars continue. Across the galaxy, Jedi Knights lead the Army of Republic into battle against Sephiroth's forces. Jedi Master Yoda fights on the Wookiee Punter of Kashyyyk, but the Sith Lord Darth Sidious is about to reveal himself and draw a new darkness over the galaxy. This is, um... It, it really, this wasn't really... No one really remembered that Yoda went to this planet, to be honest, and I don't really think I did. He did go, but it wasn't that important. You know, there wasn't that much of an adventure in this. It was very hard to come up with levels in this. Um, you know, and yeah. Anyway, so we're gonna get more of the droids to defeat. Let's go. So, as you guys know, Yoda's like really slow when he, when he doesn't have his lightsaber out. So, I always keep it out. This is very important. That's quite useless. So now all the clones are going against us because of Order 66, which is to kill everything. Not kill all the Jedi, because uh, the clones are actually against them. But it makes no sense, which I never understood. Was, uh, why the clones went against them if Qui-Gon Jinn was the one that ordered the clones to come and help the Republic. That's what I never understood and probably no one else does that no one else thought about. Because everyone kind of forgets about episode 2 but then episode 3 was like a lot better so you know everyone remembers this one. Everyone's always wondering like what are these clones and when do they come back and, they're, and then people are realizing like crap these are a lot like stormtroopers. They're exactly the same, except they're just new art. So we gotta save these three things. So, you unlock Yoda and uh, Chewbacca way before you would do uh, Star Wars, Lego Star Wars um, 2 original saga. So now the reason you have Chewie here is so that you can do some grappling. I love that he can rip off their arms. That was one of the best ideas for this game. Showing Chewbacca's aggressiveness. Why can't I jump off the guy? I jump up here. I always thought these things were a little useless. Whatever. <laughs> we're just gonna grab some of these. Look! Dang, you shot off my hat. His jump is a little weird, though. No? Let's go. Have fun. Mm -hmm. Alright, here we go. Um, mini kit! Is that our first mini kit? Let me just check. Yeah, that was our first mini kit. It's always good to at least get one mini kit in this. I always thought that that was like the most cool thing ever. Alright. And we have fun chewing. <laughs> Thanks. I'm oh, sorry. The sound down. I always thought it was kind of cool to have like a certain amount of things you need to get in order to beat the level or continue. You know, it's really cool. I did that in like a Batman as well. Like, that was a lot of fun. I remember that I once like let them just like crawl around and there was like a hundred clones or something here and <laughs> I don't know how they all spawned out. Thank you. What I thought was a little weird about this level, which I kind of hate but also love, is this. This cutscene. Look at that. You know, think about this, is that, like, we've got to, like, battle this. This is, like, this is, like, the entire thing. Now, my question is, why did they stop producing droids? I mean, I know that they had the clones and everything, but what was the point of stopping 
What was the point of stop? What was the point of not producing these guys anymore? I mean, the droids were doing pretty good. I mean, without the clones, the droids were pretty destructible in episode two. Blow those things up. Just keep moving. <laughs> Alright, we use the force. I always thought that this was a little... I mean, that wasn't cheeky or anything, but... What doesn't make any sense is, like, why that took me so long. Alright. Now, so that, that was a little hard to figure out, too, because nobody ever uses those, you know? Unless they're like aiming to get the true guy. And so now our ship is sinking, which I didn't understand this. Why we could try to use the force in order to get it back up. Like You know it's back, but what's the point? You know, because now it just goes back down. Give her a freaking mini kit? Sure. I can understand that, but. Oh, no. Boom, two mini kits. This is honestly one of the coolest aliens ever. Definitely a vast improvement from what the other ones were, you know. We think about it. That's what he sounds like when he dies. Playing this game so many times, I know where everything is now. <laughs> I think there might be another. Mini kit. Please don't. Okay. The only thing I didn't like about this game was that there was like no fall damage. To be honest, I think that these guys look. I think that these guys look better than the stormtroopers. Their design. Not to say that I, that I like the idea of them having a new design from like the old ones. But like I like the old ones more. I honestly think that the stormtroopers are the worst. Should be almost done. Yep, we're right, like right here. 
This is honestly one of the hardest, this is really the hardest part of the level. Actually trying to end it. I mean, no boss battle or anything, it's just, it's just impossible. Bam. Bam. See, this is the part. This thing starts to come up. Usually what happens is that clones come up and then they shoot you right when you're about to- Oh! We did it! They go literally, it was luck. Yeah! Yoda and Chewbacca. She's probably- He's over there. Thirteen percent! Really? Okay. Yeah, we did pretty bad. When it comes to studs, that's not the best. Alright. Alright, well guys, thank you guys for watching as always. We'll see you guys next time. Take care.